Hello, this is Steve Burgess from Hypnotherapy for All. Thank you for choosing this recording. I hope you enjoy listening to it and you find the visualizations, suggestions, or affirmations helpful in your quest to feel good. Now, before you play the recording, make sure you won't be disturbed for the next little while. Turn off your phone and find somewhere comfortable to sit or lay with your eyes closed. Obviously, do not play the recording whilst you're doing anything that requires concentration. For example, driving or operating machinery. If you have a history of psychiatric illness, before you listen, check with your doctor that it's okay for you to do so. Hypnosis is just a pleasant state of relaxation. So if you need to come back to full awareness or respond to anything happening around you before the recording is finished, simply count yourself up in your mind from 1 to 10 and open your eyes. So when you're ready, allow your eyes to close down and simply take a few moments focusing on your breathing and tuning out of the outside world and tuning into your inner world. Sometimes it can be difficult to relax. Perhaps you can allow yourself to relax now more than you have before. As you rest here with your eyes closed, maybe you can become aware of whatever is going on in your body right now. For example, you may get a sense of any feelings that you have in your body right now. There might be colours or shapes behind your closed eyelids or just a deep, abiding, pleasant darkness. You might like to allow your mind to rest on the gentle rhythm of your breathing. And as you watch your breath with your mind, you might find that your breathing, as you begin to relax more and more deeply, at some stage begins to slow down all by itself. Or maybe just take a few moments just to focus on your breathing. Just aware of the gentle rhythm of your breath and the rising and the falling of your breathing. Don't do anything to control your breathing, just Allow it to slow down all by itself. I wonder too if you can notice any feelings of calmness in any areas of your body. Of course, there may all be some tension or apprehension somewhere, that's okay too. Perhaps you can allow your conscious thinking mind to attend fully to any tension that you may have whilst your subconscious mind allows you to relax deep now. And you can also become aware of your own thoughts as your conscious thinking mind continues its inner dialogue. It can drift off to places more pleasant than this one. Or it may be curious and want to listen to. That's okay. Just letting go of background sounds and noises. And all the time as you allow yourself to relax now. 
You can just drift and float deeper and deeper into a pleasant state of focus, relaxed inner awareness. And as you do this, I begin to wonder if you've ever had the pleasure of sitting quietly on the bank of a river or a lake or a fjord or on the shore of a lake or an ocean. Because there is something very comforting about just sitting there, listening to the peaceful sound of the water, perhaps waves rolling onto the shore, or just the gentle, soft ripple of water touching and caressing the land. Because there is something very comforting about just sitting there, listening to the peaceful sound of the waves as they move in and out. The peaceful sound of the water in a continuous flow that just seems to go on and on and on. Relaxing in the sun, feeling the soothing warmth and just letting the mind drift effortlessly. With that quiet, almost silent sound of the water in the background of awareness. I'm not sure you've ever done that before. Relaxed in that way. Listening to the peaceful quietness of water washing the shore. Or perhaps for you, you can conjure up happy memories or daydreams of a waterfall, watching the gentle haze of spray as the water touches the surface of the pool. Or perhaps for you, it would be more pleasant to imagine a silent place in the centre of the woods, where you can just sit quietly, feeling the energy of the gentle trees, hearing the stirring of leaves in the background. And just feeling feelings of contentment. Feeling safe and secure inside and out. In a place in nature so comfortable and safe that it was easy to allow the body to relax. Everything to relax now. Or maybe it was the warm smoothness of soft white sand you could hold in your hand and watch flow effortlessly down and down 
through your fingers. The same sand that flows in an hourglass, hour after hour. With nothing to do for a time except let go and flow. Warm, soft sand, listening to the waves of relaxation while you are sitting there in nature. Or maybe you've experienced at some pleasant time in the past sitting or lying in a warm, airy, quiet room, the sunlight streaming through the windows on a peaceful summer's afternoon and just finding yourself drifting into a slumber a daydream of good thoughts dreams and sleepiness well, I don't know but I do know that everyone has a place they can go. A relaxing space deep down inside where you can really let go of all of your cares and concerns. And wonder at the wonder of those waves of relaxation at the smooth heaviness or lightness of arms and legs as relaxation continues. Forgetting to make the effort it takes even to try to be aware of when that relaxation began and the soothing sounds or sensations were. Perhaps as you're continuing to relax, focusing on my voice, you can feel a pleasant feeling of relaxation, maybe even giving yourself permission to drift and float deeper and deeper inside. Perhaps you can become aware of a healing taking place inside you right now. A healing that begins to take place in your mind, in your body, in your spirit. And whilst you're resting in this way, I'd like you to become aware of a fact that you are able to make a choice a very important choice the choice to manifest well-being in your life now it's been said that within all of us there are two opposing forces that work one of these forces drives us towards good health and well-being. Physical, mental, emotional well-being. This is a constructive force. But the other force is negative. It drives us towards illness and bad health, physically and mentally. And it's this destructive, negative force that makes us anxious and tense and depressed and also opens the way for other ailments physical ailments to be inflicted upon our bodies. But we have a choice. We can all choose which of these forces to go along with, whilst we oppose or obstruct or let go of the other. The choice is real, it exists. And from this moment on, I'd like you to become aware that at all times, you can choose between health and illness. 
And this fact can be firmly remembered and remain a part of your consciousness at all times now. So make that choice now. Choose to be well. And your choice matters. And from this time onwards, your choice to be well has a positive effect on your very being. Your choice to be well shows itself now in the way that you eat, exercise, relate to others and in every aspect of your life. It comes out in your attitude towards whatever happens to you. As you choose to be well, you can feel yourself reacting less strongly to things that used to bother you. And from this moment, you can begin to feel the beneficial effects of your choice to be well. You can see clearly that your health depends largely on your attitudes, on your frame of mind, and that you can and you do choose your attitudes and you choose your frame of mind. So now you choose to be well. And having made this choice, from this moment on, you are going to become fully committed to it. And you are going now to become determined, very determined, that anything that stands between you and good health must be swept out of the way, no matter what it is. And this determination must grow and grow as you become more and more committed to your choice to be well. And as you become more and more committed to your choice to be well, so too you increase your opposition to illness. Your resistance to bad health increases day and day now. Because nothing must be allowed to stand in the way of good health. You can feel very determined about this. More determined about this perhaps than you have ever been about anything in your life before. Even now, maybe, as you think about your own determination, you're beginning to feel better. As you do this, your body moves into a positive mode. Your mind becomes more positive. You are beginning to fight your problem and you fight well because of your determination and your commitment to be well. So those two forces that lie within us need food in order to be strong. They feed on our thoughts. If we think in a positive way, then this feeds the positive and constructive force within us. If we think in a negative way, this feeds the negative force. So if we are in the habit of constantly acting and thinking negatively, then the destructive force within us becomes stronger than the positive force and we become ill in some way, physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually. And of course the reverse is also true. If we think and act positively, we become healthier, physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually. Because the positive force is the strongest. So you have chosen to be well now. And feel a sense of determination deep inside you to succeed in this. You are committed to that choice. These are positive things. And that's good because as you choose the positive, as you choose to be well, you are feeding that positive force inside you. You're starving the destructive force. You're making it weaker. And the more you do this, 
the more normal this becomes and the healthier and happier that you become. So the more that you choose to be well, the more that you create some positive thoughts in your mind, this becomes a new pathway in the mind that grows and becomes stronger and stronger. So I'd like you to use your imagination now. This is an imagination visualization that can help you to become even more successful with your choice to be well. Now I'd like you to imagine that you can see in front of you a rose, the flower, the thing of beauty. So just imagine now that you are looking at a beautiful rose, the perfect rose with a beautiful fragrance. You can choose the colour of that rose. And as you look at that rose, notice just how perfect that flower is. But also as you look at that rose, I'd like you to imagine that it has a special magnetic quality. It seems to have the power to draw from you into itself all of your bad feelings, all of your negativity, all the problems and difficulties that have been intruded on your consciousness, any physical illnesses in your body, any conflicts inside you, any sadnesses, angers, guilt, anxieties, fears, you can feel all of these things being drawn from you. And you can feel yourself letting them go, giving yourself permission to let that rose draw all of these bad feelings into itself. Imagine you can feel yourself being purified as the rose takes into itself all of your bad feelings. And this leaves you feeling good. You can feel calm, relaxed and happy. Imagine you're feeling very peaceful inside. And it feels good. It's so all those negative things just floating away from you into the rose, dissolving into the rose. Imagine you can feel an inner quietness that wasn't there before, deep down inside you, and it feels good. But this rose also seems to have another power, because as it draws into itself, all of your bad feelings, it has the ability to absorb them and transform them so that they add to the beauty of that flower. So that the rose appears more and more beautiful as it absorbs all those bad feelings that it is drawn from you. Imagine as you look at it now, it appears to have become more and more beautiful. So this rose is transforming something bad into something good. And this means that they cannot return to you. Those bad feelings are now gone. 
And all you are left with is peace, calmness, and relaxation. And these good feelings remain with you now. And the reason that they remain with you is because of your choice to be well. Just think to yourself in your mind, an affirmation, I choose to be well. I choose to be well. I choose to be well. And you can be happy with that choice. It's the right choice and you are committed to it now. You can feel calm and relaxed and content with that choice. And from this day onwards, you're going to notice a change in any negative conditions that used to bother you. Any old fears or anxieties or conflicts or negative emotional feelings. just a thing of the past. You're going to find your body fighting any form of illness all the time moving into good health. Your body feeling stronger. Spiritually you may even feel yourself much more at peace with yourself, the world and everyone in it. And as each day goes by, You'll notice that in every way you're just feeling better and better. Day by day in every way you're feeling better and better. And at any time in the coming hours, days, weeks, months, years, you wish to feel this sense of positivity, just think those words to yourself, I choose to be well. And immediately your mind will move into that positive mode, that positive mental frame. I choose to be well. Those are your words now. It's your affirmation. And just thinking those words means that you are immediately in a very positive and powerful frame of mind. So I'm going to ask you to let my voice go with you now. In a little while I'm just going to start counting up to ten and ask you to come back to full awareness on the count of ten. However, if you wish to continue just relaxing in this way for a while longer and either bring yourself back to full awareness later on when you're ready or just drift off, have a sleep and come back in due course, then please turn off this recording now. Otherwise, I'm just going to count from one to ten with each number. I ask you to come back little by little to full awareness on the count of ten. And when you come back, come back feeling calm, happy and relaxed. You have chosen to be well. And so when you open your eyes, you'll already feel an improvement inside yourself. So when you're ready now, one. Gently up to two. Slowly up to three, just coming gently back to four, more and more aware up to five, gently up to six, all the way back to seven, all the way up to eight, becoming more and more aware now, more and more alert, gently back to nine, Perhaps starting to move your hands and fingers a little bit, maybe stretch your body. Then all the way back to 10. In your own time, 
Take some nice, slow, deep breaths. Have a good stretch. Open your eyes and feel good now.